Honestly, I think this is the cutest of me. This is the best you can get. I can barely move my face. Hello. <laughs> oh, it's cracked. Ooh, it's gross. I'm about to take a shower and basically explain what is going on. What is this, you ask? <laughs> that was so weird. So I just got out the shower and I put lotion on my face and that's about it. So, <laughs> and I put my hair in two buns. So what I'm going to do is this kind of competition thing that is online and it gives you the opportunity to uh, go out to LA and do some modeling things. And Kendall Jenner does the photography because you know that girl already, you already know. Basically, I'm taking advantage of the opportunity that is 2016. The internet, you know, technology and stuff like that. They give you an opportunity to audition just by posting a picture on Twitter or Instagram, which I will do. And I'm going to take the photos today because, you know, you can't be any realer than the photos that you took today. No, I don't know. I just kind of wanted to try to take a photo. Another reason I'm doing this is because basically I want to see what it's like. You know what I mean? Because I like film and I think fashion films are superb. I've never used that word in my life. That fashion films are amazing and fashion photography is great and it's just cool to see like the concept of like how they did it. So the chance that I will be able to see what goes on like in LA, like the greatest, the greatest place of basically a photography and film and stuff like that. Just the opportunity. Figured it's worth trying. You know, it's it kind of expands on something I was thinking of a few weeks ago that I am completely like not what you expect of a model. The only thing I have that is similar to what a model is is that I am tall, I'm 5'9", which is still probably like right there above what the height is needed for a model. So I'm in no way, shape, or form a model. But the thing is that the definition of a model has changed so much in the past few years. Now you have hydrogenous models, you have more plus size models, you have medium sized models, and you just have their everything is changing because they're making it more like a realistic standard. But the likeliness that I actually win this competition is very low. I just figured like who are just stunning, like absolutely gorgeous. So there's basically no way that I would win this and like but it's like doing it so <laughs> this is the fact that this isn't even my best and then I'm trying this kind of brings me to a new confidence level that I'm kind of proud of so that's basically why I'm doing it so now I'm going to try to sell my face do you see the water dripping from here Selling the flower. The way the, t the photos are, I might put in some old photos because I look hella sexy in those old photos. I'm not gonna lie. I think I have a booger in my nose. If you saw that, that would have been nice. Just a okay. <laughs> Just did a bunch of full body shots. We'll see how it goes. I'm gonna link what this is below the article, or I'm not sure what it's called. The thing that this is. So if you want to try, like, go ahead, go, go with your gorgeous self. You win that ticket. Yeah, I'm weird. Okay. Love you guys. Bye. See you next video.